So when Jess told me earlier this year she was getting married after 10 years of courting <laughs> to a Scotsman, to a Welsh girl, with a ceremony in England, in the middle of winter, and on New Year's Eve, I thought there's got to be some sort of joke here. <laughs> Still waiting for a punchline, but I haven't got it. Did floor me, though. She was a beautiful baby, big eyes, blonde hair. She was smart, funny, and very kind as a kid. As Jess had older brothers, she got to participate in the relay when she was about six years old. Much younger than the other kids, but this little blonde, blonde shell was running like the clappers, enough to break my heart right then. She's always given her everything, and she still does. Jess started studying for her teaching degree. She had LC at 20, kept studying through a pandemic, had another child, hey Rudy, and then graduated in March of this year. Wow, amazing. What you've done is fantastic, unbelievable. We don't say it often enough, but me and your mum are so very proud of you. No tears, no tears, don't cry. I don't really enjoy public speaking. I'm not really good at it. I've got to do it now and again. Uh, but for those of us who are lucky enough to be fathers of daughters, this is one moment you look forward to. And dread, in equal measure.
I'll take a cup of kindness yet for days of old lang syne. Basically, you're passing the most precious thing in the world to you into the hands of somebody else for the love and care. That's you, mate. If you're on guest, right? We all make decisions in life. Some good, some bad. <laughs> but probably the most important decision you're ever going to make is the one you've done today. Who you want to spend the rest of your life with. <laughs> and I congratulate you. You've made the best decision in marrying this beautiful girl. Right, so first of all, um, on behalf of my stunning new wife and I, I want to thank you. I want to thank you all for coming uh, to celebrate today with us. Uh, secondly, I want to thank Bianca and Kylie for all the help we've given Jess and actually making sure she turned up today because that's. Yeah, well that, that might not have happened, you know what I mean? So we've got here. Um, and I want to just uh, raise a glass to Bianca and Kylie. <laughs> I just want to thank these two beer who have um, been with me for nearly 20 years through a lot of highs and a lot of lows. <laughs> so I just want to raise a glass to these two beers up. I think it's safe to say I'm proud of Scott sitting here today with Jess and their two children. Um, They have been with each other for over 10 years and have grown with each other. To have brought two wonderful children into the world is a joy and I'm proud um, of your young family. <laughs>